Hello, this is Renee and welcome back. Today I have a channeled message from the Divine Masculine. I feel like the energy is really deep right now. I feel like they're going through so much reflection. I can feel the energy. Let's see what's going on with them. Hey. I really miss you. I didn't realize how much I missed you until I took time to really reflect. And I have to tell you, I really don't like what I see. I'm not sure what you see in me. <laughs> I've told you time and time again that I just feel like I'm unlovable. It's just not in me. It's not in my cards. And I have this great fear that I'm going to end up alone. And it hurts. And lately I've I've been reflecting, diving deep within me, trying to figure out why I am the way I am. What did this to me? I've had countless relationships. Some I really cared about, and they always ended up hurting me. And I always ended up hurting them. Couldn't control the cheating. I couldn't control the lies. I was being the man that I was taught to be. And I know that's not the man that you need. And I'm trying to take a look at why you scare me. Why does your love scare me so fiercely? Why every time you touch me, I just... Kind of go deep within myself. Because when you touch me, it just, it does something to me. I feel your energy. I feel your love in every touch. And damn, it's scary. And overwhelming. I think that's why I run. Because you scare me. Because I know if I give in, I could drown in your love. And they would never find the body. Because your love is so deep and so pure. I've never felt anything like it. I've never felt anything that has broken my heart completely open. And I know I'm doing a horrible way of showing it. I know I've ran from you. 
I've tried to ignore it. I've tried to just block it out. Hell, I even tried to replace it. But nothing, nothing compares. And it feels like everything that I've done to try to get over you has made it hurt so much more. It's made me want you so much more. And I've done so much. I have done a lot of sneaky shit. I'm not going to lie. I wouldn't blame you if you didn't want me. So I've kind of dug myself into this hole. Because I messed up something. That only comes once in a lifetime. And of course, I screwed it up. I fucked it up royally, right? And now I'm sitting with myself. And you had me so deep in my emotions. Emotions. I'm not supposed to have emotions. I'm not supposed to feel like this. I'm not supposed to show it. I'm supposed to be strong. I'm supposed to be the one in control. <laughs> what have you done to me? Kind of kind of thing have you done? <laughs> I'm feeling all these feelings, damn it. And it's uncomfortable. I don't like it. I don't like this feeling. <laughs> because it feels so strong. And I'm yearning. And I want to. But now everything that I've done, I don't know what to say. I totally fucked everything up. The best thing that has ever happened to me is you. And I fucked it up. And I, I know you're not going to forgive me. I don't know what to say. And I feel too ashamed to tell you everything that I've done. Baby, I wish I could turn back the clock. I wish I could turn back the clock to do things right. To go back to where we first met and stay on track. I don't know where I fell off track. I don't know where I messed things up. My feelings started getting involved and I got scared. I ran. 
I wish I could change that. I wish I could do it different. I wish I could be more like you. Love more like you. I just want you to know that I have so much to do and you deserve so much better. I love you. Please forgive everything that I've done. I love you. <laughs>